So here we're Babbel today and it's a massive thank you to Babbel for sponsoring today's video and again it is a relevant one to us because since we came to France we have a basic knowledge of French um, but we we need the confidence we've needed to build that up we've had to learn and we've had to we want to be here to integrate with the French we want to be able to communicate with them feel like we're, we're a part of France and Babbel's really given us the ability to do that like I say, je parle un petit peu de France, mais c'est seulement un petit peu maintenant. So I, I do speak a little, but it's a case of it, it is only a little and I needed to be able to fill in the gaps. And with Babbel, I've been able to do it. It's designed by teachers, so it, the lessons are easy and they want you to learn and it's about learning and picking it up. And even with a few lessons, I've found myself, I've, I've had the ability to be able to do that and learn new words and, and to be able to put things in the right order because a language isn't always just a straight translation. You have to think differently and Babbel gives you the ability to do that. And um, there's no um, risk in trying Babbel either. It's got a 20 day money back guarantee, which is ideal. If it's not working for you, they, they'll give you that money back guarantee. And, and you also get two free classes to try as well to see if it's, it's something that fits and works with you. And they are really helpful. So those 60% uh, off right now with Babbel. If you click the link in the description, it's worth trying. We love it. It's, it's given me the ability and it's given me the confidence to actually want to, to, to go out. It is one of the best language apps in the world. So I'm going to get back to my app, try and use some more of my French, and then we'll go on out later on and see how I get on. When you put your hand in my jacket, I'm thinking so irrational. You flew me international now. And we could spend hours reading the signals, but that's so unoriginal. What if we took this back to my house? Under all these lights, I gotta take a minute, take a minute, take a minute to calm down. But I feel like if I told you I was ready, right this minute, do you think that it would turn you on? If I told you I was ready right this minute Would you just run off and tell someone I just feel like you need to know I don't wanna feel like we're wasting time Tell me should I go and call up a taxi We can make out for a play in the backseat Please tell me now how that all sounds That plan's time You can sleep in while I make breakfast Watch cartoons and talk about exits and if you're happy, stick around I just feel like this is worth the risk I never felt a fire like this If I told you I was ready right this minute Do you think that it would turn you on? I just feel like you need to know If I told you I was ready right this minute Would you just run off and tell someone? I just feel like you need to know right here, right now we're running out of things to talk about Right here, right now I'm about to let the truth come out If I told you I was ready right this minute Do you think that it would turn you on? You tell me now If I told you I was ready right this minute Would you just run up and tell someone? If I told you I was ready right this minute Do you think that it would turn you on? You tell me now If I told you I was ready right this minute Would you just run up and tell someone? So that's all the furniture in for the hallway for now and it's looking fantastic <clears throat> just getting these few pieces in obviously it's it's making it a, a proper room now and a proper space 
So now we've got these on, we're going to carry on and we're going to get the furniture in the salon, start placing that and see how that works together and then go from there really. But it's just, it's amazing to be at the stage to, to be finally getting the furniture in really because so we've been wanting to be at this stage for what the last three years when we actually bought the chateau but we needed to obviously do so much work i.e. getting somewhere to live and getting the ground sorted so now to be finally at the stage where we're getting the furniture in and piecing it all together because bits are from the UK, bits are from France, from Italy, from America bits from all over the world really so bringing it all together we can finally see it to see if it gels really and at the moment the hallway is better than what we expected it's brilliant so fingers crossed the salon's the same and then after that we'll be able to move on to the bedroom so we'll crack on now and get the furniture in the salon
welcome in. Hopefully you've had a good look around here. Hopefully you've, you like what you see and you like what we're up to. I'll show you around some of the unfinished bits and, and the things that we're planning and, and we're going to keep going with. So we're going to have a big beautiful mirror here. So we're still on the lookout for our big beautiful mirror. We haven't found it yet. I'm sure Terry will enjoy searching through Marketplace and Brocons and anything else. Yeah, I can't wait. <laughs> I did spot a beautiful one and it was only in Le Mans, which is literally down the road from us. It would have fitted perfectly. So the style in here is a bit Henry II for the French furniture. And it was beautiful, but unfortunately it sold. Oh. I know. So I'll keep a look it out, but we need one that's wider rather than taller. Yeah. Or wide and tall. I'm sure we'll find something. So we've got the lights to hook up. We think they'll look quite nice there. So we're going to have a little serving table in the middle here where you'll have your tea and coffee. We've got a beautiful kettle coming where you'll be able to put coffee on and leave it on all day. Um, because we know that people like to do that, so that'll be nice. And then in here, have a little fridge. Look at that. <laughs> Just for your milk and some water and probably some little bottles of wine as well. I'm sure we'll be able to squeeze in there. And I think we're looking for something for this corner as well, are we? Yeah, obviously I like the table there, but it's just a bit unfinished. It needs it needs sink like wow there. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And we can't have you sat there all day. No, I can't sit there all day. No, I'm too busy. <laughs> <laughs> We've got our pictures and the hat stands up now. Yeah. A couple of people are asking why we haven't centralised it. Well. We can't at the minute because... It was to cover a door. Yeah, it's to cover the Basically. door. And that's the size of the door. Yeah. So we'll keep this for now. I have spotted a bigger one, but it might be too big. And I do like this one. It so is nice. It's, it doesn't have to be. It's nice to have asymmetrical stuff. Yeah, it doesn't have to be exact. Like I said, the room's not exact anyway. It's, it's all off everywhere, so... Yeah, it's nice. And then we want some plant, a plant for here, I'm thinking. Yeah, nice plant there just to fill that corner space. Nice big high one. Nice. And we can set up the cards. Yes, so I think this is like one of my favourite areas. It's just stunning. We were just saying when we like how nice it is in here. We've been in here working and then we've just stopped for a bit. And we sat in here and it's so tranquil. Yeah, it's so it is quiet. So quiet and peaceful. You can just sit and watch the world, literally watch the world go by. But we were, weren't we? We just <laughs> sat there just, just watching the cars go by and birds flying. Yeah. It was beautiful. It is. So we'll go in here now, and it is lovely and cozy. And loads of you in the comments the other day, why haven't we got the heating on? Reason being, we've got doors open everywhere. We had doors open everywhere. Um, we were in and out, and it's, it'd literally just be like burning money. So that's why we didn't have the heating on. We've got the heating on today, and it is genuinely, like I don't need these layers on right now. I've got them on because we've been working outside and stuff, but. It is lovely in here. Yeah, it is really nice. Like I said, obviously we had all of the doors open on the 400 suite because we were getting furniture from the 401. And the 401's not insulated, so that's letting all the cold air in. And we had the front door open because we were up and down and in and out. So it was so cold because- Everywhere was open. Everywhere was open, <laughs> yeah. And it's just completely pointless. Yeah. So it is, but yeah, fire's on today. Patrick's happy. We're all happy, it's lovely. Like I say, it's it really is. lovely and all the little finishing touches starting to come together. So, I mean, I've near this yet. No, don't touch it. Why? Because it's glass. I'm not allowed to touch the pretty things, am I? No. <laughs> apart from me. Oh, apart from me. That's, that's okay, <laughs> that's all I need. Um, well, yeah, you just can't get the, the gist of this room on the camera. The colour, the, the colour's not the colour that it seems on camera. I think, I think it's the, the depth of it all as well, though, and you don't get that, do you? Like, no, on just, the camera. No. I think when everyone walks in, the first thing that they say is, oh, it's a lot nicer than what I thought it was. There's a couple of people that have seen it. Um, well, every say. single person that's came, like friends, people off YouTube, they've been um and ah with the green, and as soon as I walk in, they, they just say they love it. Perfect. It, so, it is perfect, like I say, when you're here and you're in this room and you feel the room. Yeah. Like I said, the different, just the way that the lights shine, the lights shine from behind you and the shadows that are created on the walls. And it is genuinely, it is a cosy, it is a gentleman's room. It is a nice cosy gentleman's room and it, it is nice for that. Yeah. So. And you stand to get your artifacts together. I am. So I've got my beautiful um, blanket that Rob kindly got me. 
um, which I've been, yeah, I've been wanting one for ages. Um, and Rob managed to get one. So it's a nice little blanket for when you're on the sofa and you just want to have a little blanket on you. Yep. And this is going to be a little artifact case. Yes. This will be a little display cabinet for all my Olympic stuff. So I'll see if you don't know anything about the ships, you don't have to, but it's just a nice little thing to have there. And then we'll have another one over the other side for the Titanic stuff. Have you, have you got some plates on that? Yes. Yeah. Plates um, and cups. And John, John Chang sent us a beautiful plate, did, so yeah, that's good. That'll be going in there as well. Yep, and then we've got a little bureau. Yes. So people can sit and write letters. Sit and write their postcards to their loved ones back home. Yes. Like back in the days. From Chateau de la Lasalle. Yes. We can even put some postcards here. Yeah, we've got Absolutely. lots of postcards, so we'll be having a nice little batch there so people can... Help themselves. Help them, yeah. And then we've got a beautiful little Georgian... Um, you can't see the details, so I'll do a close-up on it, but it is... Sorry. Oh. But yeah, so we'll have some nice little sweets in there. Mum said some soft mints. Some soft mints? Yeah. Chocolates? Yeah. Terry wants chocolates. <laughs> and then we've got a picture of Carouge, which is the chateau right next to us. It's a big you can say right next to us, 15 mile away. Well, it's, it's the closest, closest shot. It's closest one, yeah. pretty much to us, yeah. And that's a monument, so when people come there, can go there and see that. Mm -hmm. And that, that is just the gatehouse. Yeah, that's just the gatehouse. That's all it is. <laughs> and then, coming around to this, so radiator people are asking, yes, the radiators will work in time. Yes. Every radiator, barring the two that we fitted... Is off. Is off, because <laughs> we're obviously renovating the shower. Yeah. So, we do have a brand new boiler in the cellar. It's all ready to go. It's just literally a case of the whole place has to be done. And... For, for the for the year coming, it'll likely be in summer, people are coming to stay anyway. So it's really not an issue that there's no heating in here for us right now. It really isn't a big issue. Um, we've got like our own heating on the third floor. So putting the fires on, that really has warmed it up in here today. So last little bit of this room, last unfinished bit of this room anyway. Um, so we're going to have a nice telly here. We've got charging ports, USB and USC for when people are here, because we know it's so important everyone has their devices charged. A beautiful cabinet and a log store, um, just in case people do want to have fires and make it cosy in here. And with the TV as well, you'll have the capability to watch basically any movie or any series that you so wish while you're here and enjoying this suite. Um, and yeah, that's us. But let us know what you think. Like I say, we're absolutely loving the stage. We're at a point where it, it is genuinely a joy to be working in here. Um, please hit the like button, it is massively important to us, it does help us so much and it helps other people see this video that wouldn't normally see the video. Let us know what you think, Let, you don't always have to agree with everything we say, as long as you say it in a nice way, then we can have that conversation in the, in the comments. Like I said, we, we are looking for you guys to tell us what you'd expect to see when you come here, so let us know. So make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe and we will see you in the next video. Goodbye! If you'd like to be part of our journey and help restore the chateau, then please join us on Patreon, where you'll be part of our journey, receive a piece of the history, and get exclusive videos.